Discover what's possible when we think research at Case Western Reserve University. It's a part of everyday life, giving or receiving help in some way. Whether a doctor working with a patient, a teacher with a student, a manager with a subordinate, what we're trying to do is help people develop. Richard Boyatzis is a professor of organizational behavior at the Case Western Reserve University Weatherhead School of Management. He's discovered that different approaches to coaching and mentoring have different outcomes. For example, if you coach someone in a positive way. We believe that you would activate parts of the parasympathetic nervous system, which would enable them to open up cognitively, perceptually, and emotionally. Conversely, if you appeal to something that makes them feel defensive or guilty, you activate the negative emotional attractor, which causes people to defend themselves. And as a result, they close down Boyatzis took his behavioral discoveries a step further by collaborating with cognitive sciences professor Anthony Jack. Together, they studied what goes on inside a person's brain during different styles of interaction. First, they had students interviewed in two different ways. One positively focused on their future, and the other focused on the challenges they face in their courses. Afterwards, the students underwent a brain scan while watching the video clips of their interviews. We were really struck by one particular finding, which was in the visual cortex, where we really see a lot more activity in the more positive condition than in the more negative condition. What makes this study unique is the interviews focused on the participants' real life. So what we think we're seeing is the neural correlates of someone positively imagining their future, their hopes, their dreams. And we're seeing that much more strongly in the positive coaching condition than we are in the sort of negative condition. The more we can understand about the detailed parts of the neural activation, the more we can actually tailor the learning experiences. And you can imagine how much more effective we would be in helping them create new ideas to become both more effective organizations and better society. Learn more on how Case Western Reserve University thinks beyond the possible at case.edu.